got the him strike something like you run up on me i'm a gun and knife i'm gonna knife yo it's the real silver surfer here bringing you a gameplay with the sa805 with muzzle brick and rip um basically in this gameplay i'm gonna explain half of the gameplay and i'm gonna be breaking down what i think they should do for the playstation 4 in the future with this call of duty series because i know a lot of people been wondering like is call of duty black ops or modern warfare 3 or call of duty 4 is coming back for the playstation 4 due to the fact that a lot of people love those call of duty games and now you can't play it because it's not playstation 4 compatible but basically in this video i'm gonna be talking about how that should work but over here i just wanted to bring it out i was actually talking to my friend classy yeah, shout out to young classy um he was asking me oh should i use um fully full clip or should I use scavenger so I broke it down scavenger have has its flaws and full clip has its flaws scavenger you don't start off with a full, a full 240 clip but if you run out of bullets then that gun basically you can't use it for the rest of the game now scavenger has its flaws if you like that weapon that you have selected or placed on your class and you can use it for the whole game, but the only bad part about that is you're gonna if you run out of ammo, which happened right there, basically you're gonna either have to knife or run out for a scavenger package. Uh, as you've seen, I, I luckily somebody ran up on me and he got hit with the knife or with the knife. But anyway, um, that's not what I'm gonna be talking about in this gameplay. Mostly I'm gonna be talking about um, I believe that they should either make a I don't know. How you call it a uh, collection collect collective edition for playstation 4 how they should um stick all the call of duty not all the call of duties but basically the treyarch call of duties in the one disc and then the infinity war call of duties in another disc and sell them in the market basically they could either sell it for a good price like 70 dollars because remember if you buy these games it's like what four games you got call of duty 4 Modern Warfare 3 and Modern Warfare 2. Then you have the Treyarch when you have World at War, Black Ops, Black Ops 2. I think they should basically do this for the Xbox One and the PlayStation 4, how they should sell this disc or collective edition basically and and all you have to do is place it in your PlayStation or Xbox and then it allows you to pick on for more games so on and so forth but anyway and I know it will be a real big seller a lot of people like to actually play all the Call of Duty games but don't have a PlayStation 3 or an Xbox and it's really frustrating because I always love playing these new games like Modern Warfare 2 and Modern Warfare 3 and Call of Duty 4 but I can't play them because my um, PlayStation 3 has the yellow light so I basically can't play it and if you think about it it will also be lovely because you can get your Modern Warfare 3, Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare 2 or Black Ops in the PlayStation 4 graphics and that would be lovely I would love that I know a lot of people would love that I know it would be a, a big seller I know they wouldn't lose money from doing this I don't see how they would um, they make DLCs all the time and that could allow them to keep up the franchise and make bigger lobby than all these old Call of Duty games um, basically it'll probably just add more people to Call of Duty Ghost if you think about it because not a lot of people to me in Call of Duty it, it, it always starts off when people hate the new and latest Call of Duty for some reason I don't know why see me I'm the type of person I don't complain I just adjust adjust to the newest Call of Duty that's out so a lot of people they just tend to oh they're not also good at it when it first come out so they don't adjust they basically just want to complain and complain and complain and they call up Activision or they call up whoever and they basically complain 
about all these little minor things and then when they actually fix it and they still claim but the worst part about it is all these things are happening is because a lot of the people in the Call of Duty is complaining so basically a lot of people from Black Ops 2 said oh I put a whole clip in the guy and he still hasn't died or um how come I'm shooting him so much times and I get so many hit markers so now in Call of Duty Ghost they allow people to die quicker now people complain about oh I die around corners I die too quickly why is this it's because a lot of people complain about all the little things in Call of Duty and then basically it affects everything and that's not fair in the point of people that actually play Call of Duty and actually he just the like game enabled. but anyway um i believe that people should like, vote or either sign a paper of this collector's edition and see how far it can actually get people can probably actually get their wish list um, i don't think they would do anything that has to do with them not making money to me I, it makes you a lot of money seventy dollars her collective's edition and I know I'm not the only one that actually wish this and I know a lot of people actually want it so it's not like it's not just me probably anybody in the Call of Duty franchise but other than that basically in this gameplay I um mainly stay by the steps because in strike zone um uh, the spawns is so horrible in my eyes they spawn right behind you at all moment like you can, as soon as you spawn, you push towards the baseball shop, and once you spawn, chem strike. Once you spawn, <laughs> once you spawn, and then you start shooting towards that baseball shop, automatically the team is spawning right behind you, right where you spawned that five seconds ago. And this map is so small that they literally spawn behind you, and it, that sucks because now God people spawn right behind you but the gameplay is over so I can't really explain. Like, subscribe, comment below and tell me what you think. We'll serve a server here and out.